Welcome back, everybody, to... Welcome back, everybody, to Undead Legacy. I'm an old guy. I came in and we have survived the Horde night up on top of the roof of this place. The Horde did not uh, bring the building down, which is a good thing because that means we're still alive. Um, so what we're going to do is hop on our bike and get the hell out of here. Get away from the Horde. And... Um, the next order of business is to go back to the wasteland and start looting like crazy because we need to... That's the state of the building currently. Um, we need to make a Tier 3 research station so that we can then make the schematic for, the, for gas because that requires the Tier 3 uh, research station. Uh, and the gas itself requires like 2,000 research data. So we're going to have to spend 800 on the Tier 3 bench, and then we're going to have to spend 2,000 on the gas can It's schematic itself. Um, and I don't think I have 2,800. And I know for sure I don't have 30 books. I'm just checking the trader here really quick to could see what they got. be any louder? I probably could if you want, really did. wanted me to. Look at that thing, man. Morning Star Mace. That thing looks wicked. Um, So, man, I wish he had a, had the gas can schematic. <laughs> Such a pain in the ass. Uh, He's got a lucky looter. Find more lead and loot. That's about the most worthless thing in the world. Um, I did find the schematic for the mining cart. And I believe I showed that to you guys in the last episode. Um, oh, the silencer would be nice. Yeah, we should consider this for sure. It's not that expensive. I just don't have any money on me right at the moment. We might want to consider coming back and getting that. But anyway, so, you know, gas is the thing. I, I am out of gas, pretty much out of gas. I so do business with real customers. we're probably going to have to rely upon the bicycle for a little while until we can either... You know, find enough gas for me to, because I've already checked it. Ooh, maybe I haven't already checked everything here. I thought I thought for sure I had done this. Maybe not. Uh, you know, either find enough gas to continue using the the mini bike. Probably we should probably not use the motorcycle until we have the gas under control, just because it, it uses some more gas than the mini bike. I I could have sworn I got all of the gas out of here. But I met, definitely missed that one. Anyway. Um, and, yeah, so I, I lost can my... I help you? Yes, you can help me. I, I lost my train of thought. Sorry, guys. I'm a little, little scatterbrained right at the moment. Uh, but let's just take a look. You got a nice purple AK. Man, if we could just find the damn gas schematic, that would be so nice. But uh, this mod does not Bye. give things out for free. <laughs> uh, then that's not a bad thing. I, I mean, I'm... I'm thoroughly enjoying this mod. Absolutely enjoying it. So anyway, um, I'm going to head back home and I will meet you guys back at the base and we will gear up to start looting like crazy because we got to get all these research data and all these books to do this stuff. So I'll see you back at the Horde base. All right, guys, we're back at the base and uh, we're going to head out and do some questing and looting. Um, I have... About forty percent of a tank of fuel in that uh, in the mini bike, and what we could do is we could take this out of here and put it in here to help that stretch a little bit further. Um, so you know we're we're always going to be on the lookout for fuel as we're out and about, but. Uh, we need research data. So how much do I have? I've got 1,250. Okay, so w the first thing we need to do is we need to make this Tier 3 research uh, station. So let's get that uh, back on the pin there. And I've got 21 books. So we need to come up with nine more books. Uh, we have the research data, and then we have the paper. So we basically, you know, once we get nine books, then we can come back and get the schematic for this and then of course we have to actually make the thing too for whatever that's going to cost and of course we're going to loot and do all the other stuff that we would normally do so let's run upstairs for a second here 
And um, our uh, our concrete mixer thingy should be done. Oh, yes, it is. There. There it is. Okay, that's been a long time coming. Um, I'm going to just put this up here for now. This is probably not going to be its permanent location, but what do we need to make concrete mix? So we basically need sand, stone powder, and cement. So let's just get that thing going so it's just making it like crazy. Uh, sand I think I'm going to have over here. And then cement is here. And then stone powder. I think I have some stone powder. We're probably going to need to make more. Where would that be? Probably in here, right? Yeah, okay. No, not that. So we're going to need to make more stone powder. But let's get this started uh, making concrete for us. I'm going to put this down here too. And we'll put the sand down here. So what we need is stone powder the most and that I think we can make from either stone or large stone okay so let's get a bunch of that going um, let's do a that can I carry this oh yeah let's take two really that's not very heavy wow okay let's take like that much so 2500 of these and start making stone powder like there's no tomorrow so that makes 500 of those. Okay. Cool. Oh, uh, I was going to do one other thing while we're up here. What do we have? We're, we're not doing the greatest on food, so we're going to probably have to rely upon boiled meat for a while, which is fine. We can do that. Uh, it's going to say, yeah, I, th I thought I had more water. So let's, let's get some more of this cooking up. That's going to take 3 minutes and 20 seconds and... Oh, uh, we're just shy. You know what? That's okay. Let's just... Doesn't matter. Let's cook this. Okay, so we'll get that going so we have a little bit of food. And I... Yeah, I'm just... I'm really... I got a lot of things that I need to do. Just a lot of housekeeping kinds of things. Like, you know, getting our food supply back up. Uh, we got a lot of repairing to do in here, which we'll do, especially now that we can start making concrete. That's going to help a lot. Uh, there's stuff downstairs I need to fix up from what the zombies have been tearing up. And so just a million things to do. But right now, I think gasoline is still our highest priority. So we're just going to keep limping along as best as we can until we can get, you know, some gasoline made. All right. So that being said, let's go ahead and we're actually doing fine on, on food and water at the moment. So I think we're good to go on that. Um, maybe what we'll do is we'll put these down here and we'll see if we can get a couple of cans filled up while we're out and about. I am going to go ahead and take this with us because uh, I'm not planning on leaving the city. And we have a level one uh, quest to do, so we might as well just keep working the trader quest too. There's no reason not to and get, you know, Trader Joel up in the tiers for us. But we're not going to just exclusively do quests. We're also going to be, you know, just looting in general. Uh, excuse me, sir. Pardon me. Okay, let's go. Get away from here. Oh, I did uh, I did come across a bookstore somewhere in this city. I wasn't paying super close attention because I was just looking for gas at the time. Uh, but somewhere around here, there's a crack book that we can hit, too. So we will definitely be doing that. Uh, like I said, I just don't remember exactly where I saw it. Well, we got a tool store here, too. Uh, this might have... Oh, there's the crack book there. Okay, let's, let's hit that first. Actually, even before we do the quest. Get the hell out of here. Okay, so, yeah, uh, we might, uh, we're, uh, we'll almost certainly find all of our books in here. And maybe we'll also, um, you know, the best case scenario is we find the schematic for the gas in here already. Man, you guys are just relentless, aren't you? Whoa. Okay, 
Alright, off with your head. A little bit laggy as usual. Okay, let's take a bandage. Okay, and start getting books. We only need nine books. There's one right there. Uh, we... We already know that. Yeah, okay. It's good. There's some research data. We need that, too. Yes, indeed, we do. Uh, arrow rest? Sure. Yeah, let's learn it. Let's learn it. Okay, there's book number two. So seven more to go. Book number three. I'd be very surprised if we don't find nine books in this place. Oh, man, the lag is so bad. All right, I got to look at this, you guys. This is just driving me freaking insane. What's our quality? Quality set to custom. What could I turn down that might make things a little bit better? Screen space reflection effect. Let's, I'm not, I don't know exactly what that does. Let's turn that down to medium. Let's turn water down. View distance is medium. Shadow distance is middle. Let's turn that to near. Grass distance, put that on medium. Anti-aliasing is already off. Depth of field is off. Motion blur is off. Occlusion I can't turn off for some reason. I don't know why. Uh, bloom and screen space ambient occlusion. Let's turn that off too. Okay, so apply all that. Dynamic mes meshes, mesh distance. What does this do? Player and POI block, cha block changes will show in the distance. Okay. The mesh distance, written distance meters, always rendering of the day. Okay. Dynamic mesh options. If true, renders the distant meshes, including more details. I've got 64 gigabytes of RAM on my computer, so I don't think RAM's really an issue here. User interface. All right, well, let's just try these settings. Um, it's a, it is a little bit better now. It doesn't look quite as good as it did before, though, does it? But I think performance is going to be a little, little more important. We got a double on that one. We're still a little bit laggy, though. Even with those changes. But I think it's improved a smidge, so. All right, great heist. What's this do? Learn how to craft time charges. You know what? Let's let's learn that because we might use that at some point. Maybe. I don't know. I'd rather, kind of rather just, you know, pick the locks, though, because, you know, then we get the skill up for doing it. Nah, it's still laggy as... Oh, look at that, you guys. Nice. That was a good find. It's still laggy as hell. I don't think those changes really did a whole lot. I mean, I've got a reasonably powerful machine. I've, I'm running a, th a 3060 Ti graphics card. I got 64 gigs of RAM. i7 processor. Um, X-series processor. So my machine's... Halfway decent, but... Oh, look at that. All right, we'll learn that, too. But, uh, you know, it, so it's probably more of the game than, than me. But Seven Days to Die is never... In the entire time that I've played this game, it's never been real well optimized. At least not on my machine. So, you know, we make the best of it. There's a thing here. Okay, let's check these cabinets. A little honey action there. Microwave and this. Okay, those are locked. Let's go, uh, yeah, let's keep checking the bookshelves. Okay, more books, that's good. I think we already hit everything over here, right? Pretty sure we did. Make sure I didn't miss anything. Okay, check this. Okay, there's another book. How many books do we have? We have seven, so we need two more 
Two more to go, folks. Two more to go. All right, let's go. Anything in here? Not really. Probably not much in here either. We'll check this, though. Yeah, I those changes didn't do a damn thing. I, I'm, I'm still lagging as bad as I ever was. So let's go. Why don't we put the quality on high, but I do want motion blur off. And I've never really had a need for anti-aliasing in this game either. So let's just do high, but with those settings. Let's see if it looks a little bit better than... Okay. Now back. Yeah, see, this, this looks nicer. And it doesn't seem to affect anything in terms of uh, performance. Okay, so let's go back here. Check this guy. I'm sure, we're going to probably have Zeke's back here somewhere. Some glass. Might as well check all these boxes. Ooh, look at that. That's uh, more research data for us. Nothing there. I th I think the wasteland is just kind of a hard place to be graphic graphically speaking. Anyways, well, it's a hard place to be in pretty much any sense of the word. <laughs> but uh, we'll just we'll just make it work as best we can. That's all we can do. All right, so let's get, check these up here. And then over on this side, we got a chamois box up there. Okay, let's open that up. Nice. And I guess that's it for in here. So that door's locked. Uh, we go outside, right? Yeah. Oh. How many Zeeks do we have? <clears throat> Get out of here. I'm trying to kill the cop. Okay, let's let him blow up because I don't really give a shit. And there goes the door. What's that? Scrap glass. Oh, he <laughs> he blew up the dumpster. That's funny. Okay, we'll check this. Crack a book. Okay, come on, give us something good. Great heist, uh, use no stamina while sneak sprinting. Yeah, that's a good one. And pumpkin seed. Yeah, we'll learn that too. We'll eventually get a farm going. That is my intention uh, to do that. Just all basic stuff here. But you never know what you're going to find in these boxes. So they're worth looting. Uh, okay, up here. Probably have buzzards up here. There's a dude. Oh, I need to make some more arrows too. I'm like uh, quite low on arrows. Like I said, I got a million things I need to do. I was going to say, there's probably somebody in there. So I'm come on out. Um, Go ahead. Oh, you went out that side? Dog. Where's the dog? I heard a dog. Okay, we got to jump down there, but before we do... Let's just finish checking things out up here. Edgar! Come play, buddy. Oh. Off with your head. Grab these. Nobody in there. Okay. Let's jump on down here. Check this. Weighted head mod. We already have 
at least one of these. So I think I'm going to scrap that for the research data. There we go. We're going to learn that. Um, and then we have some fish tacos that I've been saving that I was going to make a schematic on, but now we don't need to. So we'll just eat those when we get back home. Where the hell's that dog at? Outside there. All right, yep, we'll learn those too. Food schematics are <clears throat> really important in this mod because there's no perks that you can learn to learn the food, so. Oh. How did that not wake up Janitor Jake? I don't know. You know what I don't have on me are bobby pins and um, uh, the candy stuff. I've got it back at the base, but I don't think I don't think I have it on me. Darn it! All right. Well, I guess we'll have to come back for the fat loots. Let's open this up. Um, sh nah, let's scrap. Let's scrap that for the points. Get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, did we get nine? We didn't get nine books. <laughs> Can you believe that? <laughs> we didn't get nine books out of the freaking bookstore. Oh my goodness. I, 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 I can't believe that. I just can't believe that. Is there a key to let us out of here? Uh, I don't know. All right. Well, um, like I said, I'll, we'll have to get some bobby pins and we'll come back for that later. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're not done. We're not done. We got stuff up here. That I don't care about. Plus, I have one or two of those anyways. All right. Let's check these real quick. Medical thingy. We are wearing our luckies, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, um, that sucks. We're two books shy. Two freaking books shy. I did check all these, right? All right. Well, let's just keep on keeping on then. That's all we can do. So, I was going to look uh, next in the working stiff, so let's check that out next. There might be some gas here, I don't know. Hey, Rapacious. He tough. He not tough. What's this? Scrap wood? Nah. Uh, all right. So let's uh, let's check the vehicles. See if we can get some good stuff out of the working steps. Yeah, that's not quite what I had in mind. Check this guy. I need to go back and get my bobby pins, obviously. There's a snake over there. Red SUV? And is this lootable? Nope. There's a ton of cars that we can take apart at some point. That door's locked. A little bit of tea action. What are these? Oh, those are ATMs. Okay. 
That's cool. Any lootable cars over here? This one is. Nice. Oh, baby. Yeah, I'll take it. A blue desert vulture. What the hell's going on down here? Nothing that I can see. Huh, okay. That was a nice find, you guys. Um, I don't have shit for skill and handguns, though. <laughs> we might have to start working on that, huh? There's a mini bike over there. I don't think those vehicles are lootable. Well, let's head on in here, and I guess we need to take one of these. Let's drink some water. Let's take a miso. And a red tea. Those are beers. I don't I don't think I have read the thing where the beer doesn't make me all messed up. So might as well scrap a couple things here to free up a few more slots. I'm not taking 13 clay or four rotting flesh. Or that, or that, or that. We got plenty of that stuff. Seven nails and... Uh, this could be scrapped, too. Yeah, nice pistol. Oh, my goodness. A C-level pistol. Uh, okay. Well, I'm not going to do anything with it right now because, again, I don't have any skill in it right now. So let's just take a look and see what's going on in here. There's lots of cement in here, and there's going to be some shelves, of course, that we can do. And we have the Zombos that are going to come and say hello. Him out. Everybody's coming out of the ceiling. Oh shit. Off with your head. What do we got here? Oh, uh, that is an upgrade. And we don't give a shit about the... Well, you know what, though? We might need those for... We might need those for, like, making the auger and stuff. Let's... Uh, we know how to make the auger because we found the thing for it, the schematic. No, nope, it doesn't require handlebars. Uh, yeah, let's just scrap that then. Okay, so we just got an upgrade to our sledge. That is very nice. Let's, um, modify this. Take all of these guys off of here. And we have another mod slot that we can put something else on there too. Fantastic. Fantastic. All right. We'll take it. We'll take it. I want all of this cement because uh, we need it, right? So, oh, I don't have my shovel with me. Damn it. Okay. I'll have to come back and get that later, too. Well, let's check these shelves. We might luck out and find, like, a nail gun or a nail gun schematic or something. Most of the time, these shelves have jack shit in them, but you'll never know until you check them, you know? There's a bobby pin. Got a dog coming in. Try out my new sledge, dog. How do you like that? We better heal up some more. Nails. Bobby pins. Okay, I think there's a safe in here, right? Uh, no, there's a, well, there's a working stick. Let's just break this down. Oh, a battery bank. Okay. We'll take that. Yes, indeed we will. And the fat loots are up there. Should we just nerve pull up and get them right now? Maybe we'll get a, a quest for this place later and then it'll reset. All right, 
so we want to be right about here. Oh shit! I forgot there were zombies up here. No, 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 don't blow up! Shit. <laughs> oh, I'm stuck! Oh my goodness, not good. Okay, take a bandage. Now get this out. I completely forgot there was a bunch of Zeeks back there. Here, let's take another bandage. I just love it when the zombies hit you without even moving their hands. What the hell, man? That's bullshit. Fortunately, Edgar got stuck in here. Dumbass. All right, let's get back up here. So we have three bobby pins, but I don't have the stuff on me. So that's right. I keep forgetting that damn things are locked. All right, we'll have to come back for this one too. So we have two locked chests at the bookstore and the tool store that we got to come back for once I uh, go back home and get my candy. There's a repair kit. That's welcome. Water action. Did we check? Yeah, I think we already checked those shelves. Didn't check this one. Anything over here? Check this cart. That one we hit. Got a couple iron plates and a more another chain mod thingy. Yeah, this is all just bullshit though. I mean, it's just crap. It really sucks. Used to be able to go into working stiff tools and have a reasonably good chance of fun is good shit. Now you just get crap. Okay. We have a bear outside, which makes me nervous as all get out. Where the hell is my wrench? I left my wrench at home. Dude, this is terrible, man. <laughs> I'm just leaving everything I need at home. All right, well, let's check these boxes. I'll come back here with my lock picks and all that shit and my wrench to get that because that's going to give us steel. There doesn't appear to be anything in here. Oh, shit, that bear. Yeah, we're not taking any chances with him. We are not taking any chances at all. So I'm going to go back to the base, get the lock picks uh, or the candy and the lock picks and the wrench. Um, and then I'll meet you guys back here. We'll open these two chests and then we need to wrap up the episode. All right, these guys are being a pain in my butt, so let's give them a little something something. What the hell, man? Get the hell off of there. I kill him? This AK sucks so bad. <laughs> Alright, he uh he definitely damaged our ladder there. Okay, let's uh grab that. Uh some more seven six twos. Okay. Uh I guess I don't have as many bobby pins as I thought I did. I only have the three, so uh, I don't know if we're going to be able to get into those chests or not until we get more. We'll try it. We'll just see what happens. We need to get the blacksmith's uh, level two station, which actually I think I know how to make it, but there was something that was holding me up last time and I can't remember what it was, so I'll have to look at that. Okay, so let's see if we can bust into this one in here. So we're going to 
take a jailbreaker. And yeah, we have three bobby pins. Okay, what do we got? Ooh, nice. S level iron chest armor. That's not bad. Um, actually, though, is it as good as this? It is not. Ah, that sucks. Okay. Not quite as good. You must repair this. Ah, uh, screw that. I'm not repairing that. Okay. Uh, let's see if we can get into that other one. And I'm going to... Here, let me grab this stuff real quick. This concrete. And we want to also take this... Uh, vending machine apart back here except for there's the bear I think he can come through that door once he breaks it yeah let's not let's not chance it can he can he or can he not I don't really want to expend ammo on him oh yeah he can I figured he could okay let's get the hell out of here Okay, let's go back here and see if we can pop up in this chest. Didn't I just kill you? Guess I didn't kill her. And we got it. All right. Nice. Purple military vest. That's a nice find. Um, If we decide to go light armor at some point, that is a nice find. We'll definitely keep that. Okay, so I think that's going to wrap things up, guys, for this episode. Uh, we will plan to, to work the trader quest in the next episode. I was going to do that in this episode, but we just didn't get to it. Um. So, yeah. I might, uh, I might take... I need to take a day off at some point and and gather resources. I need to go mining and, you know, get food, that sort of thing. But I'd really, I think, I think we need gas before we can do that. So we need to keep looking, uh, you know, for what we need to get gas. So that, that's the most important thing. So yeah, in the next episode, we'll, we'll do the trader quest and, um, just keep looting here in the town. So that is it. Guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we will catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.